two, three, yeah, if that. something like that. So, I mean, we're still very, very, very early. But obviously, we've had time to, to develop tech in this game already you know, exactly. from the previous iteration. Um, so, we'll see. We're going to see what happens with this game. But I have, I have high hopes, and, and my expectations are certainly high. Exactly. And the things that I see out of this game now, I like. I'm, I'm really loving Melo's team here. It's, um, I mean, Horan got buffed like crazy, and Steve did too, but yes. the pressure that he puts on you with Horang is, is just ridiculous. Everything is safe. Yeah, that's the problem, is that Horang is, is not only is he safe, but the pressure that he applies is unorthodox, right? Mm -hmm. He'll raise his leg. You know, things that look like they hit high <laughs> don't hit high. Things that look like they're going to start up and hit low. I wish they did. Yeah, like it's weird. You know, like all of his approach angles. And that's kind of neat. You know, it's, it's kind of awesome uh -huh. as a wiring player. Right. It makes it really fucking frustrating to play his ass. Oh, absolutely. Gotta, Ooh, that's an overhead. That's an overhead. Uh, Ooh. Uh, this where you think he's going to stop hitting you. Nope. Uh, here comes Steve. Uh, no, uh. instant overhead to all this? Uh, yep. All this. This game is so dangerous, people. Yep. People wanted a high damage game, they got it. They got it. You're welcome. They got it. <laughs> Dear general public, you're welcome. Exactly. Capcom. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Sincerely, Capcom. This Paul is fucking dead. Oh, oh. <laughs> that, nice. is, that is wow. dead. What was that, two touches? About. Yeah. I mean, two significant ones. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's that's about what it comes down to now. And, and that's what you, if whenever, whatever team you put together, you want to have that. Yeah. You want to have that touch, and you use very little meter in this in this too. Right. Two, maybe three levels. Done. Yeah. Actually, the meter management is one of the things I think has been about one of the strongest things are aspects in the game as well. Oh yeah. I think they changed the meter game as well in this game. I believe that you gain meter more quickly. Uh, 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 uh. Nice Look at this shit, Dude, Steve. Nice punish. Yeah, very nice. Uh uh uh. God, that hurts. Ooh, that is there gonna is. hurt! Oh, he tossed this in there. Let's go. <laughs> Why does he not Ooh. have a follow up to that, man? Yo, Marduk. Oh, that's a counter! <laughs> so sick. Yo, Marduk is controlling shit, right. though. But see, the thing is, notice what we were talking about, right? Uh -huh. Like the whole Marduk finishes combos himself, he does a lot of work. Yeah. But, and he's gonna, yeah, he's gonna get him out with that basic boost. Exactly. But you, it, we got, aside from boost nice. combos, there's almost nothing else you can do. Nice, went low. Love the throw game on here. The meta game in regards to throws is just beautiful now. Mm -hmm. You cannot, mm -hmm. you cannot sit there. You have to worry about being thrown now. Right. It, throws hurt and they take red. I mean, come on. Taking the red is the big thing. Yeah. Like when you when you look at somebody get thrown now. And you see the damage come off, it always looks more significant because <laughs> right. of the fact that you're not seeing the red light anymore. <laughs> like it's, it's interesting. Look at that. Harong does not want to get thrown right exactly. now. Exactly. And the, the more red life you have, the more of a risk it becomes, right? And the more likely somebody is to go for it. Yes. Nice combo, by the way, Absolutely. by Juan right there. You talk about a psychological deterrent. Right. And Juan is mauling in the corner right now. He's got all the control in the world, just doing what he wants, yep. gets the overhead. Dares him to, to, to roll because he's gonna punish that shit with a throw. That and that huge backdash that Paul's got. Wow, really? Yeah. That was not jab punishable? It, I, that wasn't a jab. I think, uh, I'm pretty sure Steve was going for an overhead. Damn. I don't know why. That should have been a jab because that would have gotten his ass up. Executioner, I would say. Yeah, I would, I would have to be. Yeah. So, Corn Alakar. Oh, oh, oh. Wow, he just swum up there like bitch. Yeah, what is what is happening? What was that? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like Quarang's movement is so good. Well, he has the, uh, the empty dash. Yeah, he does. He has the misstep too, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, like yeah. he's got all kinds of stuff. Like Quarang is in general is in there. Oh yeah. Nice. Nope, that is not safe. Oh, but he's oh. not punished. Oh my God. Nice. Halloween. Uh 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 uh. uh. Paul is in. fucking dead. He brings him back in. Oh, good God. In the background, Paul is still getting his ass whooped. Are you kidding me? That just happened? That was ridiculous. Okay. Nice. Hallow, by the way, I saw what you saw posted forever ago about Marduk Jack. The team works except for getting to Jack. If you're going to put Marduk on point. You're going to have to figure that one out. Oh, that was an overhead, oh, good apparently. Man. He's got three of them. That's, that's ridiculous. And I'm not even sure how they look. Right. That's the problem. <laughs> Nobody does. Not yet. We're, that's the other thing about the infancy of this game. We're gonna have to find out so much about how much these player characters are. Absolutely. Um, you know what their real capabilities are, things of that nature. See. 
Oh my god. Oh yeah, see that wasn't the end of that combo. That no, was supposed to be all. a loop. Not at all. Just oh, ran god. in and did it. I like that about Tuan's game. The reason why Tuan's Blitzy game to me is strong is because he doesn't have that fear of approach. Not at all. At all. Not he at will all. get in your face and he has no he's very comfortable there. Because he understands how important it is. Psychologically he understands how important it is to get in and uh, bully your opponent. Right. Bitch. And then while you're sitting there, while you're frozen, not knowing what to do, guess what? He grabs you. Exactly. That's the thing. Is he's already made up his mind about what he's doing. And that's right. actually the thing to, to keep in mind, right? Is that when, when somebody like that or that has an offensive game that's similar in style uh -huh. gets in like that, they already know what they're doing. Exactly. You are the one that's now making a choice. And they don't really care what it is because they've already made theirs. Yep. Exactly. You know, it's, it's smart stuff. And more often than not, it's going to work out for them. Right. Exactly. Oh, oh. oh, that could have been more too. Yeah. It's deceptive that that's not punishable. A lot of those thief strings, you'll get that backdash directly after. That overhand is punishable? I believe so. Wow. Uh uh. Yeah, that was not safe. You did not backdash after. Nice, nice dash, bro. It's a big strength of Marduk's game, too, since his dash is so quick. Oh, no, that was a. Ooh, he does not get the punish. Oh, this, oh, the counter! He, oh, he needed that. He needed that big time. Yeah, big time. He does not. Wow! wow. Yeah, he does not drop that when he plays <laughs> me. Let's see. Fucking smasher. <laughs> Damn. The hitbox on that stays out so long. Damn. I would be so fucking tight if I get hit with that. I'm not going to front. <laughs> if I was mellow right now, I would be completely mindfuck. I'd be so salty. Nice. He's Take going in. I, I, I respect is what he's doing right yeah. now. Take Responding with his game. I like that he's seeing on the blocks too. Yeah. Nice. It's impressive. Um, an execution error could cost him. So so quick to hit buttons, Melo. Oh Smart anticipation on the forward roll by Melo there. He gets a full punish on Marduk because of the fact that he knew that Twan would be looking to get uh, Paul out of there. Oh my god, this is so scary, Gun. Wow, get him out, get him out. And here we go. I mean, Twan is on match point. Yep. Getting ready to run punish. it back against Seth Lowe. Oh, that was a punish. Where? Oh no, get bopped. Damn, that was 40%. Jump in fast. I think Melo's mind is gone on this one. I think so. I really. Ooh. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh no. We got Yomi. We're gonna do it. We're disrespectful. Oh, there yeah. it is. Right, we're just gonna go in. Fuck yeah. Oh, oh, we tried. Yes, yeah, so he's feeling himself super hard right now. Feel the love. Oh my god. This could be big. Damn, that hurt. It isn't over. It's kept. It just kept going. Nice. Oh, right back to the corner. I dare you to do something. Oh, empty jump. Oh, gets crushed by the launcher. Smart stuff by Tuan. Very nice. All launchers do crush lows in this nice. game. Wow. Nice. That's what he wanted. Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh uh. Yo, Steve Fox. Wow, that didn't catch the backdash? That projectile is ass. <laughs> right. It disappears. Right? He's like Tekken's damn. Damn, just punch him in the chest. Ooh, don't wow. backdash, bitch. Yeah. Oh, 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 what? That was fucking godlike. I'm stealing what the, that shit. What? He just punched what? him in the chest. Why, Lord? Why? Tagged out and said, here, how about the scoop? I when, don't think you were thinking about that. When's it going to be my turn?